uh, what's up with you? I heard you were, you were dating recently. Who who's your new man's? No, like right now. Well, right now I'm like in between man's. <laughs> you are. I met someone yesterday, and um, <clears throat> I don't know. I, I the thing is, is like I I have I I'm attracted to all these like men who are more conservative, like Turkish men, Arabic men. And then I introduce them to my YouTube channel and they look at me and they're like, holy fuck, this woman is like super not conservative, super the opposite of everything they can ever go for. And then I'm fucked. So maybe I should yeah. go out with a friggin' somebody like, I don't know, fucking uh, American or white. I don't know. <laughs> you know they're going to want you to convert to Muslim Islam too. You know that, right? I know. Uh, I can't stop smoking weed. Uh, I was, I was yeah, I mean, I guess I'll just go get ready for the day. And um, gotta go to Montreal. <laughs> I'm apartment hunting right now. So wait, wait a minute. You're going to Montreal? Wait, can I ask you though? Are you <laughs> are you and uh, Natter really one thousand percent done? Is it, are you guys are done? No more. Yeah, nothing? of course we're done. Yeah, we're done. But I don't. I shouldn't say of course because. What do you mean? Yes, we're done. But no, I'm not going there. I'd be going there to see Tony and then to go apartment hunting. So. Not for him. I stay away from Lachine when I go to Montreal. Is Pete's moving with you? <clears throat> yeah. Good. Make him pack up the house while you're fucking out apartment hunting and shit. <laughs> um, what yeah. I was going to ask you do, you, do you think that Nader should be able to keep his channel after uh, putting the dukes on old girl and all that? After he's been exposed? Honestly, like, I don't know how, like, I don't know what to think about, like, do I think he should pay for that? Yeah, but, like, in personal life, do I think he should be deplatformed? I don't know, that's tricky. Like, with deplatforming in general, like, just, I don't like, know. Do it live? What's that? Uh, mm -hmm. no, it, it, it was, a uh, it was, a uh, FaceTime that somebody Yeah, it was, like, on Facebook Messenger, you know what I mean? Yeah. So it that might leave. be YouTube's problem right now. They might think, well, this is all stuff that he's done in his personal time. However, they did deplatform Andrew Tate. So I don't know. I that's just their thing to do these days. YouTube's trying to clean up. They want to go towards podcasts, is what I'm hearing. They want to push podcasts. Oh, really? That's going to be their next big thing. Yeah, that's why you see like all the big YouTubers, they're all starting these podcasts. I'm glad about something. Um, real quick, I gotta ask uh, Chantal while she's still here. Hey, you, did you see that Repsion has uh, taken notice of you? Yeah, I know. He's coming uh, what's for your, me. What is your thoughts on that? <laughs> what is, what's he gonna expose? I'm exposed every day. Like, I'm canceled Are you worried? Are no. you worried? Worry what's what you what? for? Well, What's he going to give I, me shit for? For speaking up about something I didn't like that he said? That's what he's mad about. Like, why so, is he mad at me? So what happened exactly? Can you can you tell us? Because he, you know, was planning on... He did all these fucking tweets. I'm going to fucking fry a natter, blah, blah, blah. That's all fine and dandy. But then he's fucking totally victim shaming, in my opinion. So it's the, okay. like, the way he said... He's basically blaming me for giving him a platform. It says, uh, yeah. Repsion on Twitter says, I guess Foodie Review really wants me to hammer her in the start of my upcoming video. I don't mind, but don't cry too much when it's showcasing hammer, how bad exactly. you are. He's a piece of shit. This is the thing. Man. Why is he hammering me for anything? For having an opinion on what he says? He's a fucking I piece of crap. So I don't I care know. what he fucking thinks. It says, Honestly. Uh, I don't care how many subscribers you have. I'm not scared of you. I'm not intimidated by another fucking person on this platform. I don't give a fuck. If you're wrong, you're wrong. I don't care if you have 800,000 subscribers or you don't. So I think he's trying to say that you introduced Natter to YouTube. Uh, yeah, said, well, okay, but what's his point by that? I don't know. It says, his introduction to YouTube was through you. You admitted you got him started on his channel, and then he used that to target others, older women. You also dismissed uh, the chart. He says you also dismissed the the charges, you know, that you filed on him, even stuck in an abusive relationship. 
I or you, we are still responsible for victim what we, shaming. Victim shaming. Victim shaming. Because shaming here's you? the thing. Here's the thing, of CJ. These people want to cry all day that I introduced him. Let's rewind. I introduced him, talking to him as my fucking dating him, and then every time he was abusive to me, I came on and outed him for it. So which one is it? Are you happy that he's been outed for the abuse? Because without me bringing him on here his abuse wouldn't be outed either so shut the fuck up and also like why are you gonna blame Didi? i had no idea he was talking to any of these women that he's targeting using his platform people like jennifer corvina people who are fucking older than me and i had no idea he's talking to these people that was done with Didi. so are you gonna go after Didi in your next video repsion because that's who you need to focus your fucking attention on dipshit Serious. You, know you know who we gotta get you in touch with? Uh his ex girlfriend Maya has some accusations against him that you should probably look into. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Maybe. Yeah. I don't you know, give a shit about this guy. You know which I one is it, Chantal? Do you want Chantal? What do you Chantal, what do you, do you wanna do you wanna play the victim, Chantal, or do you wanna be you know anti victim? Because it, like you know, you seem to play a different card on that every every day. You know, like do I wanna play the victim card today or do I wanna be anti victim today? You know, like, and, no, and like you talk about, happened. I don't care what, what all this and that. You like, like you've How's gotten to happened? the point. You've gotten to the point where you don't care. But there was a time, believe me, there was a time you cared about what everybody on the internet thought. You know, and just because now you can get high and like forget about it. You know, like whatever. You know, you people evolve. You know, like a lot of people evolve, not just you. Mm -hmm. You know, like. I don't know. I don't know what you. Last thing about Repsion, right? Did you said victim blaming, right? Uh, Chantal, he said, "I'm not victim blaming by saying his Natter story." Uh, sorry, I'm not victim blaming. Uh, saying his Natter story starts with Foodie a review. It does, and factually, that's how I do my videos. It starts with her helping him create a YouTube channel and him then targeting older women financially. So saying he's he's saying that you opened up like all these oh, older women on YouTube exactly. to be exploited, mm -hmm. exploited exactly. by, by That's him. why he's full of shit. That's why he's full of shit. Everyone knows that's that. fucking bullshit. Are you fucking kidding me? Helped him exploit older women I didn't even know he was talking to? When? In the video on Sam's Bar Lounge of him with his little fucking harem. I wasn't even in part of that. So again, you have no proof you're gonna he ha my problem is he has a huge fucking platform, CJ, and he's using it to fucking victim shame just because he he doesn't like that I called him out. He's a fucking piece of crap, just like the rest of them. And you know what? Like really, like he's gonna honestly blame me for that with no what where's your proof? I need proof of this. Like look, it's fucking I, stupid. Look, I don't exactly like Repsion. I think it's extremely hypocritical. I've seen him he judge. Is, I've seen him judge Onision for years about bringing like his uh like his public relationships to the forefront publicly. Wayne, he just did the exact same thing with his last ex girlfriend. He calls really? Onision a he calls Onision a groomer, but it's come to the light that I guess he was talking to his ex girlfriend when she was underage. There's all mm -hmm. types of accusations mm. and things he said about you know other people that he does himself he's very hypocritical and i don't Most know reaction just channels kinda... are hypocritical like they are that's the problem but yeah, yeah he's very hypocritical but he's also now completely using his platform to fucking victim shame completely and be like and not only that but make up lies that i'm responsible for him victimizing other women that i didn't even know he was talking to at the time that i'm a fucking victim of him fucking around behind my back with these people and lying to me to get money and shit out of me like you know what i mean so it's like just because these people don't like me they're willing to uh, dehumanize me and side with natter or try to make everyone else in this more of a victim and make me look like I'm in on it. You know what I mean? Like Dee, Dee if anything had more of a hand in anything in the Sam's bar lounge videos, she knew of all this shit, not me. So like, it's fucking stupid. And, and honestly, I hope he does do a video on me because I'll gladly fucking retort it and fucking pick it apart and make him look like a fucking dumbass that he is. I'm not afraid of him at all. Like if I can get yeah. I mean, we can go. talk about it. Like I honestly, like, I don't know. Like, I don't know. Like, I don't want to start like a whole like uh, battle with fucking Repsion now. I just wanted to make it about the point that he's fucking like what he's doing and saying. You know what I mean? Like, he's fucking he's I in just, the wrong. And then he's now a, a war against me because I speak out against it. Like, that's fucking stupid. Well, he, I, 
he really he clearly thinks that you're you know you open the door to uh you know allow Natter to go and victimize these women out here. That's that's his thoughts, I guess. Mm, okay, well, yeah, maybe. But you and I will be in touch behind the scenes. How about yeah, that? yeah, we'll talk. We'll talk later. Yeah, we'll talk later about it. But yeah, I was kind of surprised that that even happened. I don't think he's interested about the Repsion thing. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I know. Then. <laughs> yeah. Because I don't care. I'm not I don't care if you have like a eight hundred thousand subs. I'm not gonna fucking kiss your ass and like agree with what you say just because you have more like you have a bit of influence on the internet. It's hard and all it's gonna do is help you. It's gonna bring people to your channel. You're and- right. So okay, go get yeah. it, Rebs. I dare you, you know. Oh no, Rebs yeah. gonna give her exposure. I expose myself. I get exposed every day by about 20 fucking reaction channels. So, I mean, really, do you think I'm honestly fucking afraid of you? Like, especially when you're when you're saying bullshit that I can easily prove is wrong? No, I'm not a fucking afraid of you at all. When you're in the right, you know you have nothing to fear. So, who fucking cares? Right. Yeah. Uh, like, if anything, it's going to fucking help you, so. Yeah, you're right. It's true. Shit, so I didn't realize how long. Like- What's he gonna but, say? Oh, what do you mean? Well, no offense, but most people think she's a liar, anyways. Okay, tell us something that we don't <laughs> know. Okay, then knock us off. But we'll be waiting because it ain't once. Happen. Once your reputation is ruined, you feel so free. I'm telling you. Isn't it a nice feeling? Isn't it great? <laughs> yeah. It's just like okay, I've done worse. <laughs> yeah. I get well, it. Anyway. It's gonna well, her. I don't know why you're so big on it, CJ. Because think, I mean, if anything. We ought to go and pick a fight with him so he fucking fucks with us, so we can grow. <laughs> I, bro, I, I don't, I don't like, well, I don't like Repsion. I've seen how hypocritical he is. I've just seen a lot of stupid shit he's done and said. I know you did videos I, about him. I didn't, I didn't, I don't think I watched all yeah, of those. I, I, I need to rewatch them. I've Let's just go seen White Knight for Booty Booty and piss him off so he starts yelling out. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I, I don't know. Fuck him, though. Seriously, he's just really, really hypocritical. I hate people who are like that, and yeah, that's the reason yeah. why I don't like him. You know? It's yeah. Just, I don't know. This, I think it's this, is this like tweet I saw him recently. He was like eating squirrels or something like that, barbecuing squirrels. That was fun. <laughs> if you missed why? that. Why? Like, you can go to a supermarket and buy a fucking steak. Yeah, Wait, you've, nev- you've never eaten squirrels? I have. I've eaten squirrel before. Is it you, good? You have me, and if you don't want to hear that, you know what I mean. If you don't want to hear wait, that. That's wait, what's going on good, here. Good, what's going? Good what's, wait, what's going on here, food? That what's shows that you're in the show. What opinion? That's my fupa. I don't care your... what you think of my fupa. Because I'm sure you gotta show it. Sure. If you can talk about it, you're insecure. Mad. You're about it. You're insecure. You just smoke a joint. You smoke a joint, and you're like good to go. Hey Henry, confidence girl. Why don't you get, get sober? Why don't you get some YouTube Why don't you get sober and have that confidence? I bet you can't do it. I bet you can't do it. I am sober right now. And I just-